She's a politics, and you're never gonna find another one like this. Opposition is useless. This is a moment for your life. What kind of day? She's a politics, and you're never gonna find another one like this. Opposition is useless. This is a moment for your life. What kind of day? Peace. <laughs> Here we go. Another day from the desk of apocalypse. Mm. And uh, uh, I was reflecting on, I'm gonna try to move kind of fast because it's a lot of stuff in my head. But look, check this out. I was reflecting on, you know, Richard Smallwood had this song that they used to sing back in the day at Union Temple. And it was like, um, it was, the words were like, I told Jesus, <laughs> be all right, mm -hmm. if you change my name. Yeah, so listen, there we go. We want to talk about the unknown. You know, I was reflecting after watching the Million Man March 25 years later on when I first got my ex, when I first joined the ranks of the Nation of Islam and FOI. You know, and I was so excited, you know what I'm saying? So we, we start learning about the unknown. You know, the X is the unknown. You know, so I was Brother Michael 17X. You know what I'm saying? When I got my ex, I was so excited. I didn't want nobody to call me Michael Lee no more. You know what I'm saying? I had a job, you know what I'm saying? He used to say, look, Mr. Lee, no, 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 no. If you can't call me Michael 17 next, just call me Brother Michael. You know what I'm saying? I was excited. And you know, you get, but it's the unknown. You know, so I start signing it up. I say the one and the seven. You know, one to represent the one God. And the seven represent perfection. Then you add the one and the seven. You got eight, which is that symbol of infinity. But when you turn it upright, you know what I'm saying? You got the two ciphers. They connected. You got the higher self. You know what I'm saying? Gaining power over the lower self. That transformation. You know what I'm saying? You science and all up so but the process man of learning the process of self-discovery is basically what i'm talking about because it's a journey man it's a journey who is this unknown you know but then and at that time you know i have cousins on my father's side big anthony lee you know big ed lee you know what i'm saying big turns big boss you know what i'm saying so at that time man i started going over there more and fellowshipping with them and just, you know, getting to know that side of myself because I got to know the transformation. You know what I'm saying? I, you know, Pops wasn't, we wasn't, we didn't grow up with Pops, man, but, you know, shoot, I love him all the same because I am him. You understand what I'm saying? So, but this, this process and then my Uncle Eddie Jr., you know, that whole journey, man, was that journey of self-discovery. You know what I mean? That journey of self-discovery coming through a phase in my life, man, to get to a point you know, to where I am today, you know what I'm saying? But the journey of self-discovery, the power that's in the unknown. See, a lot of times if you don't, if you're not told, sometimes, you know, for the most part, you don't know. We like to say that what you don't know can't hurt you, it won't hurt you. Man, that's a lie. What you don't know can kill you, you understand what I'm saying? So we on this journey, this journey to self-discovery, you know what I'm saying, you know, and walking down the line, you know, when the Amin Mr. Louis Farrakhan blessed this man with Muhammad to be able to wear the name Muhammad, you know what I'm saying, that's a big task, you know what I'm saying, I remember sitting in the car the, the first day I met Milton D. Muhammad, all rest his soul, and he teaching, I'm sitting there for about 30 minutes while he teaching, then he comes, then he turns around and says, what's your name, brother? <laughs> I said, Brother Michael 17 next. He said, oh, you have to be careful with such a name. <laughs> he said, with such a name, brother, you can go to the extreme on either side. I said, good God about it. <laughs> so that was something to study for the rest of my life, you know what Because it's so true. So listen, there it is. Man, so get on and stay on the road to self-discovery. You know what I'm saying? Because there's power in the unknown. Uh, uh, power in the unseen. Oh, <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, so that's it. That's our word for the day from the Deaths of Apocalypse. You know what I'm saying? You know, we make mistakes. We made some mistakes yesterday, but yesterday gone. We had today, and you're probably going to make some mistakes today. But, hey, listen. Pop, pop, pop. Bob and weave, stick and move, plant and swing, use the whole ring, fight the wind. Dig, that's our word of the day from the Deaths of Apocalypse.
stay on the discovery of the unknown, the discovery of yourself. Listen, so we're gonna promote Black Dawn, Black Dawn. It's the name of the group, Shine. It's the name of the album. You can download, you can stream on all the digital platforms. You can go to www.dogfacemusic.com forward slash Black Dawn. We are in editing mode with our book, Walking the Road to Recovery, Nine Steps in Motion. Coming soon, coming real soon. Peace.